Hello guys, this is GeeseCut16. Welcome back to Let's Replay Banjo Tooie. Uh, today we're going to enter the final item collecting world of the game. And taking it via this bubble here. And we're going into the sky, apparently. So here we go. World 8 is Cloud Cuckoo Land. And we're going to be cuckoo after this world. Now I said when I was doing the, pic the uh, picture, this is going to be the weirdest world of the game. It is. Some of the stuff they have it is, but this is actually a pretty fun world. I really like this world. As you can tell, each of the... It's, this is a world. It's a cloud in the sky. It's got a bunch of islands. Um, there's some over there. There's a trash can. There's wombas. Uh, there's that thing, and there's something at the top of there, so... Yeah, a lot of exploring to do here, so... Let's actually first get started by talking to this guy over here. Let's see what's up. Basically, a little physical exercise for a ball. Not really. Yes, you do, Banjo. Right, I'm Mr. Fit, and I'm really fit. Very fit, I am. So fit, in fact, that if you can beat me in three events, I'll give you my fitness gold medal. That's nice. It is, actually. As you can probably see, event one is the high jump. The bar is set at my best height. All you need to do is jump over it to win. Okay, so Mr. Fit says if we can beat him in three events, he'll give us the uh, fitness gold medal. So first, so the, uh, so yeah, the first jump, first challenge is the high jump, and we're going to have to have something a little bit have something to actually help us set that bar, so. So, yeah. Okay, over here, these are the main transportations of uh, the Cloud Cookie Land, those blast plants. They'll actually take you from island to island, so. So, yeah, and oh, we got some dirt piles we're gonna actually uncover. Oh, what's this? I, f I found a strange looking seed. Is it edible? Okay, I want to eat. I want to eat that just yet, Kazooie. So yeah, yeah. But so those. Are, that's one of the main mechanics. Uh, those are beans. Are actually, that bean. You'll see what that does later. Let me see. Okay, that one has an empty honeycomb. That one has the other bean. So we just need two. Okay, that one just had nothing. Okay, this should be the last one. That one has honey. Okay, so um, here's a pair of springy step shoes. And you guessed it. This is what we're going to use to uh, actually uh, actually uh, use for the high jump over here. So yeah, going over here to the high jump and then per se. There we go. We beat the high jump. Uh, how did you do that? Never mind. We'll move on to event two when you find me. Okay, so we beat him event one, but we still got two more events to go if we want to beat him. Okay, the next event is going to be a sack race. And it's going to be a little while before we actually uh, see him again, so. So yeah, but for right now, we're going to do some exploring. We're going to do some exploring here before we uh, do anything with him. Okay, we're going to go into this uh, little uh, area right in here. This is the uh, main cavern in here, which is the central cavern. Now, most of the notes are going to be in here, so... Oh yeah, watch out for those little, these little dudes that pop out of the, uh, pop out of the ground that carry weapons. Like, this one carries a flower, that one's a candy cane, one's carrying a, a, a sausage, Okay, there's the candy cane. The guy thinks it's Christmas for some odd reason. Okay, yeah, this is the only other warp pad that's in this world, so. So, yeah. Ah! Ah! Yeah, 
this is what I was talking about. These guys can be very annoying because they can pop out out of nowhere in front of you. And can catch you off guard, so be careful. And, oh, looks like we got a safe over here. Greetings, fleshy ones. Wow, a talking safe. Correct. I am a Super Stash Deluxe. Four digit infinite combination reinforced strong box. But four digits only gives you 10,000 combinations. Hey, no one likes a wise guy. It's it's enough up here. Let's have a look inside then. Oh, that might be a problem. I seem to have forgotten my own combination. Perhaps they should have they should have spent a little more on your intelligence chip. I know. Sorry, fleshy ones. But if you can find the combination, I'll gladly open up. Okay, so the Super Stash Deluxe over here has forgotten his own combination. And if we can find his combination for him, he'll open up. He'll uh, open up this safe. Okay, and speaking of which, the uh, first one is going to be over here. Whenever you see a bunch of red gooey stuff... That's where the combination is. Where you can find the combination, so. And we're gonna start by going down here, actually. Let me be stuck on Clockwork Kazooie eggs. Okay, so this is what you need to do fire a Clockwork Kazooie egg, go into the little gap with the little red uh, jelly or jello, I don't know. And over here at the end, there is a button over here. So explode up. So if you explode it, and it'll press down. It looks like we got the second combination, which is nine. So we got three more to find that's around Cloud Cuckoo Land, so. Uh. Okay, uh, let's go up here. Have you looked inside this pool yet? Uh, no, I haven't. And it's a good thing you said that because in here is uh, one of the globos. One of the final globos of the game. Okay, we're gonna go down here first. So we're gonna do some exploring before we start on jiggy. Before we start getting the jiggies. So. So yeah. Okay, over here is another part of Cloud Kiku Land. There's a Kazooie Rock, so let's break it. Oh, we're going to gap in the pool there, and all that water is going to drain. But where is the water going to drain to? Oh, it's going to go back down to Teddy Dactyland, and... It's gonna fill Dippy's pool up. Okay. So now Dippy has some fresh water. Yippee! My pool's full of water. Where did it all come from? Huh. So yes, Dippy is saved. Mmm, tastes heavenly. Well, it did come from the clouds, Dippy. Did it? You said it wouldn't just drop from the sky. I lied. Just drink it and be happy. Oh, I am. Here, take my odd-shaped gold tooth in exchange. Okay, so that will be the Jiggy that will... Well, the last Jiggy for Terry Dactyland, so... Terry Dactyland is now complete, except I gotta go back and get that last Cheeto page. And then Terry Dactyland will be fully complete. Okay, I want to see something here. I don't think the, um... Uh, there we go. Don't fall off, Banjo. Okay, there's nothing up here, so... Okay, nothing to worry about. Okay, so let's uh, continue on in our exploring thing. Exploring thing. Uh, yeah, I don't have anything clever to say, so.
Okay, um... Okay, let's go down here first. Ah, get away from me. Because down here is another pool area. That I have to go lead back outside. Oh, I about to drop my controller there. Don't want to do that. And here is the final globo. Get back here. Get back here, you varmint. Got him. There we go. So, yeah, that's all the globos get and the folks get, guys. Let's see. I actually need to be out here because. Let's see. Oh, what's this? This ass cube looks familiar. Hey! Hey, young man. I'm George Ash Cube, stuck up here at this perilous altitude. What happened, George? I was out walking on the icy side of Hellfire Peaks with my wife, Mildred, when a huge blizzard came along and blew me away. Why not stay up here? Lovely view. I'm afraid of heights. Now, I reckon I'm above the icy side, so if you could just give me a little push. Okay, so let's give George a little push. He thinks he's above the icy side of Hellfire Peaks. So let's see where he's going to end up, actually. No! Wrong side! Tell Mildred I love... And that ends the couple known as Mildred and George Askew. Mildred got destroyed by Banjo and Kazooie, while Mir uh, George got destroyed... Let's see. Mildred was the one that got destroyed by... Uh, by the, uh, shoot, what do you call it? Mildred got destroyed by us, and then George got destroyed when he thought he was over the icy side, but ended up in the lava side in that little pool. Okay, oh, here's another one of the combinations right here. To the Stupor Stash Deluxe. And this one is, uh, one, I believe. Yep. Alrighty. Get away from me. You get out of here. Okay, um... Yeah, the first part of this world, I'm not going to be able to get, I'm not going to get the first Jiggy. It will be to a while until I get done exploring. Let's see here. We'll go out this way. This should take us to uh, Mum to Mum Moscow, I believe. Yep, but we're not gonna see him just yet. And uh, so, can I run away and go across here? Yes, I can. Okay. Okay, yeah, that was just a waste right there. I'll have to be flying. I'm just going to start laying down the uh, the mat, the beans, and do some exploring from the outside. But I forgot I didn't have any. Oh, I still got that guy somehow. Yeah, that's probably what I'm going to do now. I'm going to start flying so I can, so I can, because I'm going to lay those beans down. Yeah, I was thinking about splitting up and do Kazooie's thing, but, um, but that's not going to happen because, um, um, the only way to seed down, you have to be Banjo and Kazooie, so. Alright, so let's start, we're going to start laying some seeds down here, so. First area is right over here. What the? Someone's in the air. Defend your Jiggy at all costs. So yeah, while you're flying, uh, Grunty has planted these eyeballs, jig I think it's called eyeballs jiggling plants. And while you're in the air, 
You, um, you will be shot at with eyeballs, yeah. Over here, you just, when you see a hole like this, you just lay down the seat. So yeah, um, so yeah, that's how that's gonna work, and it, you can't destroy it with a grenade egg or anything, so we're gonna have to find something a little bit more powerful to actually take those eyeballs out. Okay, that, uh, beam right there will, I laid one beam down, I'm gonna lay the other one. Let's see. Okay, sure enough, go fetish to make it back over. Yeah, just barely. Yeah. That's alright. I don't I don't need the the invincibility uh the vulnerability wing what the vulnerability wing till much later. Okay, we're gonna do some more exploring. Let's see here. I'm gonna fly off top right up here, so let's see, is this where we need to be? Yep. Yeah, this is where we need to be because um, this is uh, this will take us to the top of the central cavern. Let's see. Stuck on clockwork eggs here. Okay, I gotta be careful. This be right here because we're so high up, and I have no more vulnerability. I don't have no more gold feathers, so I can't use the vulnerability wing. Okay, there we go, got rid of him. Okay, there's the treble cliff. Okay, so there's the other uh, small hole over here. That will add to the, go to the third uh, combination number right here. Okay, this one's A, so we got one more left to go. Okay, so now I'm going to be very carefully walk my way back because that stupid freaking bee is back. You die! Why? Because you suck. Yeah, I hate bees. I'm, I'm actually scared of bees. Believe it or not, I'm actually scared of bees. Another secret from Geek Squad 16, folks. Yep, I have a phobia of bees and wasps. I'm, I'm terrified of bees. It may seem hard to think, do, but... But yeah, when I was a kid, it, it doesn't affect me as bad as I do now. I want to say I don't have a phobia for bees. I mean, I still get freaked out over bees and wasps, but when I was a kid, I was terrified of bees and wasps and anything that stings, but... I've gotten over it now. I mean, it's still there, but... Yeah, everything's good and... What the? Are you guys seeing this right now? Wasn't there a blue mumble skull? Ah. Okay, something's something's fishy going on right here. So we're gonna see what's in here. Cause there's there was two. There was a blue one. Now there's a red mumble skull. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay, so that is the uh, last gin. Okay, that's the red Jinjo family. Red Jinjo family. Mumbo's sleeping, so let's see what he's doing. I guess he's going to take some nap before he actually does his final job. Hello, Banjo. Mumbo has big surprise for you. Ooh, I like surprises. Surprises. Unless this is not a jump scare, I'll be fine. Okay. What the? What the hell? Har 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 har. Foolish bear, you fell straight into my trap. I'm not that pathetic shaman you think I am. I'm Minji Jongo, and your worthless quest ends here. As you can see, there's no escape, and resistance is futile. Okay, so we have the fake Mumbo, aka Minji Jango. Bizarre, my lord of disguise is ruined, revealing my evil cyborgticness. Okay, Minji Jango, you know, he's another easy boss. He's gotta watch out for his attacks, though, so. So, whenever you have a chance, run into him. So, yeah, just watch where his attacks go, and then take your shot whenever you're near him.
Okay, yeah, then he'll occasionally stop for a minute, and that's when the opportunity should check. You should take shots. Okay, when he's down to four heart po health points, he'll heal a uh, fire and then disappear. And this buff buck, and this is where it can actually get a little bit hard because um, his attacks can actually home in on you. So stop right where you are, and then as soon as he fires, get out of the way. Like this. Well, actually, I didn't. That didn't actually work out. Hurry up before. Okay, there we go. Oh, God, he's right there in front of me. Okay, one more hit. Ah, oh, just about had him. Yeah, he gotta be quick whenever he uh, stops firing when he try to attack him. Got him right there. Bizarre! I gotta calculate my chances of stopping you are now minimal. And. They gum! Green blood? Very E rated. Okay, we get the jiggy. And you'll explode. Okay, so yes, uh, that was the fake mumbo, Minji Jongo, so. The one in the blue mumbo skull is the real mumbo. That's actually what we're going to do next. But I'm um, um, actually going to go ahead and end the video here. So we join next time on Let's Play Banjo uh, Tooie. Let's replay Banjo Tooie. Um, I should be able to get some of the jiggies in the next video. So, so yeah, that's going about. So join me for that. I'm going to actually end it here in the central cavern. Alright, guys, that's going to. Alright guys, that's gonna do it. This is Geese Quest. This is uh, Geese Quest 16 signing off. Later.